I'm about to show you how to make some easy, easy passive income by jacking the attention of viral traffic off of social media. This is just, I don't even know why I'm doing this because this is what I do in real life and I'm letting you guys in. So by the way, if you want more exclusive content like this, be sure to hit that subscribe button, go to the YouTube channel, hit the subscribe button, stop being petty. So what I'm about to do now, is I'm gonna show you how to take viral content, okay? And make passive income with it, no matter where it is. Right now we're on TikTok, and all I'm doing right now is I'm looking for something viral, okay? I am looking for something viral, something that is going to capture my attention. Okay. Okay. So now I'll show you what's this right here. This little, uh, this little thing has been going viral. Okay. This little, uh, whatever you call this, it's a, um, it is a TikTok filter. That's been going viral and it's got some, you know, music that goes along. With it. So that's what uh, that's what's going viral right now. And so a lot of this has been trending. It's all over my for you page right now. And so um, so what I want to do is take this right here pink nine mm and that stands for pink nine millimeter okay referencing a blicky and it's also referencing a um it's also referencing the song you know in the trend but anyway this is going viral right now okay so look this video alone has a hundred thousand likes 398 comments and then eleven thousand three hundred plus uh favorites okay that that this is going completely viral everywhere, okay? And then all I gotta do to give you a prime example, I can just click on the song right here. And again, this is the song that's associated with it. And now I can show you that you know it's it's just now really starting to take off, but it's it's going viral. Look at this one: five hundred and sixty-nine thousand plays. This one, 1,000 plays, 806. So this right here is about to be a trend that's going to take off. And so I am catching this trend early. So now what I want to do is I want to go into Google. And then I want to type in what I want to type in. I want to type in. I want to type in. I want to type in song. Nine millimeter song. song. Let's see here. Let's see if we can find so what I want to do is so watch my watch my pink. Okay, here it is. Watch my pink. Here we go, right here. So we're going to go right here. All right, and that's that video, okay? So watch my pink. So what I want to do, is first and foremost, we're going to take this. Watch my pink 9mm. And then I want to go, actually, let me copy this. I'm going to copy that. And then I'm going to go here. I'm just going to type in watch my pink. Okay. So watch my pink 9mm. So what I want to do is I also want to go over to Google Trends really quickly. And I want to cross-reference this. Okay. I want to cross-reference this. Okay, so it's already getting 2,000 searches a month consistently. But people are searching this in for different reasons, okay? Pink 9mm, that's usually somebody that's searching for the actual device. 
But what I'm going to do here is I'm looking for something. This is why I'm looking at this. I am looking for something about this trend that I can monetize, okay? This one right here, let me get editing. Something about it, something about it. Whether it's the song or a slogan. Let's look at some of the comments. No one is talking about the reflection on the hood and the shadow. Okay, minimum 50 TB. Best trend out there right now. Okay, one day ago. Okay, if only this was timed correctly. I love the reverse dance. Okay, I love the trend. This trend is amazing. See, everybody's calling it a trend right now. Oh, man. So they want me to verify myself to keep to keep going. Um, who is this dancing little girl? What's her name? Let's see something here. Now this guy definitely has CP. Why? Why? Okay. Uh, shadows, though. Nice skill. Oh, the gummy pink. Nice. I love the trend. Okay, so everybody's recognizing that it's a trend. And I want you to see something. Everything that's written here in the comment section is, is comments that's been written within the past 24 hours. So this trend is still early. Still early. So now... Okay, so now what I want to do... Oh, I just figured out what I can do. So... I'm going to go here to chat GPT and I want to make sure I have Dolly three selected. I just figured out what trend I'm going to go with here. So you got to do, you got to reverse engineer. You got to, so I'm going to say, create me an anime style girl with a school dress on blonde hair. And she's holding a pink, water gun she's dressed like a schoolgirl. let's see if it gives me that that was a little sketch just describing that the chat gpt it sounded a little sus but let's see okay let's see what i want to do i want to capture this trend i'm going to capture this trend i'm riding the waves okay these this is the stuff i do in the background I don't even, this is not even associated with my personal brand, but this is stuff I do in the background to capitalize off the internet while everybody is liking posts and doing all of that stuff. All I'm doing is I'm looking for viral content because that viral content is going to allow me to monetize. It's very simple. Very, very simple. Oh man, here we go. Look at here. Here we go. Here we go. So this one right here. So let's go back and look at this one. Okay. So we're not trying to copy this exactly. We're just trying to get very close to this image. Very close. So this one here. Okay. So I want to copy this one. And then now I want to drop that prompt back in there. Drawing of a blonde haired anime girl in a school uniform aiming a pink water gun with a playful expression on her face. And then I'm going to say, um, I'll say make the background of the photo white. And then I'll say include, include the whole body of the girl. the girl in the drawing okay so i'm gonna hit enter see this one right here that we're getting close with this one so we're gonna ride this trend you crazy you think i'm not this is called trend jacking this is when you're monetizing a trend that you didn't even create and i know man the haters out there they're gonna say oh that's not ethical everything is ethical this is marketing 101 and the reason why this is so important is because money follows attention. Gary Vaynerchuk told everybody this money follows attention. So when I see everyone has their attention on something, 
I try to jump on it early, very, very early. And this song, as you see from the comments in this video, this song and trend is about to take off. It's a, literally about to take off. All right, so here we go. It didn't include the entire image. I don't know why it's doing it sideways like that. But perhaps I don't like that. So what I'm going to do, drawing, I'm going to say, turn the image upright. So let's see here. It's it's getting the drawing down pat, but it's not giving it to me in the way that I want the drawing to be given to me. I want it to be, I want the whole image uh, vertical, you know? I don't want it sideways like that. But this is cool. This is, you know, I'm letting you guys in to what I, this is what I call sniper marketing. This is this is some spy stuff. This is behind the scenes, you know, behind the scenes. Low key doing this when nobody knows it, getting on a trend before everybody does it. Now, what I what I do with this is going to be very, very powerful. OK, this is how you monetize. This is how you start you know, leveling up in life. Okay, now we're starting to talk. Now we're starting to talk, especially with this one here. It's getting close, okay? So vertical. I want to say, make the image vertical and include her entire body from head to toe. This is now, now we're talking. Now we're talking. You about to see what I'm doing. If you, if you, I don't know if I could, I, I don't know if you heard the music when I played it earlier from this particular song. I can't play it that long because of copyright anyway. Um, but there's, there's the lyrics are watch my nine miller go bang. You know, that's the, that's the lyrics in the song. And all I'm doing is I'm just, we're going to ride the wave. You know, we're not overcomplicating any of this stuff. We are simply riding the wave of a trend that has been made public that's it okay so it's it's definitely not listening to me correctly okay so so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna do this vertical girl her entire figure is visible against the white background okay so what i'm gonna do i think i could still capitalize off of this though honestly so what I'm going to do, just so that it's pulling from new memory, I'm going to open up a new chat right here, and then I'm just going to drop this in here. And we should make, a, a you know, at least an extra, depending on how long this trend goes, but off of this trend, we should make, you know, anywhere from a couple hundred bucks extra per month to a couple thousand dollars extra per month, depending on how long this trend goes. You never know what TikTok. TikTok is a very fast platform and something could be trending today and it could be not trending tomorrow. So you, you have to keep that in mind. But again, this is just passive income. We're going to make something off of it based on how we set this up. So that's the key here. We're going to make something off of it and it's going to pay us without us actively being involved in it um, in real time. OK, so this one here. All right. So we're going to go with I'll go with this one right here. I'm just going to go with this one for right now. And then basically what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to downloads and then I'm going to call this nine. We'll call it nine mm. And we're just going to save it. And then I'm going to go over into, I'm going to go over into Canva. And then I want to type in t-shirt, enter. And I'm going to select this blank template right here. Actually, actually, I just had another thought. I just had another thought. I'm going to use this right here. I'm going to use this template. And I want to customize this template. And then what I want to do is grab 
my image that I just made with ChatGPT, and I'm going to I'm going to upload it inside of Canva, just like so, just like so, and then I'm going to put my picture there. So we have our picture, and then let's see if we can take the background away from this. I'm gonna hit background remover. And let's see. Yes, just like I wanted. Just like I wanted. We took the background away from it. And then I'm just going to hover over like this. I want to, I just want to do a few things here. I'm going to take the image of my, yes, I want to take this here. I want to make this more pronounced. And then just like that. And then I also want to take this and put that just like that. Just like this. Yeah. Okay. And then I want to send this layer backwards. And that's what I'm looking for right there. I want to bring this here. I'm just going to, I want to detach. Okay, these are not actually text, okay? So what I want to do is I want to, I want to put the words, let's find some text here. What I want to do is, I want to select this. I'm going to say, watch my, I'm going to say, watch my, we have to ungroup this. And then once I ungroup it, I can move these independently. Okay. So watch my, I want to say, watch my, and then I'm going to put nine, mm 9 mm we're gonna move her up just a little bit more so watch my 9 mm actually we're gonna put it like this watch my 9 mm Hmm, it's not really going like I'm thinking about here. So watch my 9mm. And then I'm going to take this. That's a different font. So I'm going to put bang. And then I am going to move that out the way I'm going to hit effects and I want to make sure this stands out so I'm going to give it a white trim actually I'm going to give it a black trim and we're going to give it white letters okay this is looking sick already so watch my then I'm going to go here Watch my, and then we are going to, I, you know, it's very important that the letters are legible, that people can actually read it. So I want to use some pretty basic font here. And I want to choose maybe that pink, watch my nine, and then we'll put this nine millimeter. We'll put that in black letters, I meant black outline with white. Watch my 9mm, and then I'm just gonna duplicate this, and then I'm gonna put go, go bang. So go, bang. Watch my nine millimeter go bang. So what if I did? <laughs> I think this is going to be 
a really good seller. Unless you copy me, unless you steal my idea. If you steal my idea, know that I'm coming. No, I'm just kidding. Man, I'm I'm just free with this stuff. All right. I think I like this a lot. Watch my 9mm go bang. So now I'm going to save it as watch my 9mm go bang. I'm going to literally save it as that. And then I'm going to download it. First of all, let's check the size before I download it. So I'm going to go down to custom size. And then I want to select pixel. And I want to make sure that the pixel is at least a 4,000 uh, by 4,000. So I'm going to just put 4,000. And it's going to automatically adjust. I'm going to hit resize. And then this page should refresh in just a moment. And uh, this is how you make money online. You just got to know... You know, you just got to know how to do it, you know, because it's all about traffic. And if you can get traffic off of something that's already going viral, you're in the green. So now what I'm going to do is save this as a transparent background, hit download. And all that sh the transparent background is going to remove the black. I don't want that black bar around it. Maybe I should have that black bar, but we'll see later. I'll see. I'll see once I do what I'm about to do next with it. We're about to see after I do what I'm about to do next. All right, we're 21 minutes and 38 seconds in so far. And uh, we're almost to the point. We're almost to the point. Oh, what happened? What happened here? What just happened? Something just happened because my little download button, I'm just going to refresh the screen. Let's refresh the screen. Oh, I think Canva. I think Canva is something's going on with Canva. Ah, see, stuff like this happens. Stuff like this happens. Okay, so as you see, Canva is still spinning up here at the top. So you always got to have another way of doing something. Don't just rely on one thing, okay? It keeps saying we're offline, but we're not even offline. So if I refresh it. So anyway, Canva servers are down. So what I did is I came over to another software called Photo P, Photo P E A. It's like a free version of, you know, a basic Photoshop. But what I did is I came in here and I hit new, and then I made a project and made the width 4,000 by 4,000 pixels. And then I drug my, I took a screenshot of my image in Canva since it would not allow me to download it. So I just took a screenshot of it and then dragged the screenshot over here inside of Canva. Okay. And so this is why I'm saying you you can't just you, you can't give up. Things are going to happen. Software is not perfect. So basically what I'm doing now is I'm going to save it without a uh, I'm going to save it here and then uh, I'm going to hit save. And all I'm trying to do is stretch it to a stretch it to a 4000 by 4000 uh, pixel image. And then I'm just going to label it as 4000. We're going to use this as a test right now. Then I'm going to go over to Redbubble. And then I'm going to upload this image inside of Redbubble. Just drag it there just like that. And let's see if it goes over these images the way or over these products the way I want. Redbubble is a platform that is going to allow you to do print on demand. Uh, Redbubble gets a tremendous amount of traffic to it every single month. So the items that I have over here on Redbubble, they just sit here. I don't even promote them at all. And a lot of my stuff, Redbubble... Uh, they promote for me, so I don't have to worry about any of it. You know, I just do my thing. If I go to a platform right now called SpyFu, I'll just drop Redbubble in there really quickly. I forgot the M. And as you see here, it's getting around 9.7 million SEO clicks every single month. For some reason, they are going down. I don't know why, but uh, around 9. 0.7 million SEO clicks every single month, okay? And that's a lot of traffic going to Redbubble every single month. So now I have my image here and I'm going to scroll down and just like I thought, look at that. This is looking nicely, very nicely. 
Okay, very nice. Okay, very, very nice. It's not the way I want it to be on every image, but, 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 what I'm going to do is I'm going to go back over here to chat GPT and I want to see something else. I want to, I want to know something. I'm, unfortunately, Canva died out on me. It's just weird. Come on, Canva. What's going on? I, pro, I talk about you guys all the time. So now I'm going to go and I'm going to tell chat GPT, create me some more images, but please be sure to capture the entire body this time. Okay. And chat GPT images don't really quite like it, it, it understands, but in many ways it still doesn't understand. Like when you're trying to tell it to include the whole body, sometimes, you know, it just doesn't compute, you know, but anyway, um, all we're doing is just driving traffic to this stuff. That's all we are doing. That's all we're doing. Now I can go in here and manually, you know, remove the background and all of that stuff. I can go in here and do that, but I don't want to. That's the point. Me not want to. Me not want to, man. This one is interesting as well. That's interesting. So let's see here. Do we have any more? This one is also interesting. I don't know why it's uh I don't know why all the images make her sideways. It's really weird. I'm saying vertical. Anime style animation of girl going on uniform. Okay, so what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna take this prompt. Go here. And I'm going to drop it in here again. Maybe the vertical is throwing it off. Maybe that, maybe me putting vertical in the prompt is making it, you know, confused. But you see where I'm going here. This is looking nice already. I just got to get the sizing right. But look, it's going to put this item on all of these products right here. Now that one already looks good. Look at that. That one looks good too. You know, anything that's like a rectangle is already looking good. Let's see. There was an error generating the response. Come on, chat. Now we got chat GPT uh, acting up a little, acting a little naughty. Okay, Canva's back up. So now I'm back on Canva. I'm back on Canva. Yeah, so we back on Canva now. Now, here is something interesting. Okay, so we're back on Canva, and I'm pretty stoked about that. I don't know what was going on with Canva earlier, but we're we're back at it like a jackrabbit. And um, I am simply using my imagination here to... Now, as you notice, my image didn't really turn out the way I want it to because it's got these sharp edges right here. But I'm going to try to do something uh, creative to hide the fact that it has sharp edges. What is going on right there? And then I'm going to drag this up here. I'm going to hide that. All right. So what I want to try to do. So I'm going to go to elements inside of camera and type in universe. And voila. 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 So um, what I'm going to do is find something, some type of image I can use to kind of camouflage the fact that this thing has these sharp edges on it like that. You know? Uh, let's see here. Maybe not that. Maybe a frame. Let's see. Hmm. 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 Ooh, I kind of like. Me kind of like this a little bit. Me kind of like this. 
Oh, I kind of like, I think I can do something with this. Let's see. Let's see if we can do something with this. I'm going to put this in this layer to the back. And then we're going to make that. I think we can do something with this. I'm going to double that and then bring this down here. And then we're going to also send this layer to the back. Okay. I think we're, oh, I think we got something here. I think we got something here. I think we got something here. So what I want to do, we just don't want any sharp edges. That's what we don't want. And then we're going to bring this down like this. I think we got something here. All right. And then now I want to take this. Yeah, we just don't want any sharp edges. Sharp edges are the enemy, okay? Sharp edges are literally the enemy. All right, so let's see. Hmm. Let's see. Rough. I want some rough edges. Maybe... Maybe the only thing about Canva is that sometimes you have to. Okay, here we go. Here we go. So I want to do. Yeah. Yeah. We just don't want no rough edges. Okay, we're just going to give it that grunge look. Okay, that grungy, grungy look. Kind of a grungy look. We'll put that there. And then here, we're just going to keep duplicating this until we have the look that we are going for. And then we're going to say back until we have the look that we're going for. Forward. We're going to move this forward again forward gonna have to move this forward a couple of times before we get it in the position that we want to have it in matter of fact uh how's your day by the way i hope i hope your day is well i do my best to uh wish everybody a, a, a great day uh that i come across because you just never know what people are dealing with out there so i just hope that your reality is absolutely phenomenal. So let's see here. Let's take this. Boom. I don't know. Now that I'm now that I'm looking at it, I don't like that side one. Okay. Like that side. Here, let's do. I just don't want these sharp edges. That's all I'm trying to. That's all I'm trying to do. At the end of the day, it really doesn't matter, but it, it, you know, it's just something that matters to me. And then I'm gonna straighten this up right here, and then put this at the top as we straighten that up. And we're gonna bring this to the front, just like that. And I think I'm gonna go pink with the bang as well. Yeah, we're gonna go pink with the bang also. Yeah, just to create some consistency. Because once we upload this, you're going to see. All right, so now I'm going to download it. Let's try this again. And we're going to select transparent background. That's going to remove the black away from our image. And uh, we're going to go back over to red bubble. So boom. And then back over the red bubble, I'm going to clear out of this. And then we're going to do this process all over again and hit add new work. And then we're going to drag our image down here. And now we should get a better looking image. Presentation is everything. Presentation is everything. Presentation is everything. I'm a massive passive income type of person, okay? If you want more ways to create massive passive income, I'm definitely the YouTuber you should be following. Not just a YouTuber. I actually own three very successful companies that are all based around the internet 
and I help companies all around the world do this. Okay, now we are freaking, listen, now we're freaking talking, okay? Now we're freaking talking, all right? Look at this. This looks really, really good. So now I'm going to go here, and I just want to play around with some images. Look at that. Look at that. Sweet baby. We about to do this. All right. So now, uh, what other colors do you have? We'll do that color too. Look at this. This look. This is looking good. Now it's looking like a grungy shirt. I don't really like it on the hat. I'm gonna enable or disable that. And Redbubble, you know, you can adjust the prices, but hey, this is just massive passive income to me. So I'm gonna leave the prices the same. I'm not gonna mess with the prices right now. Um, but what we are going to do, we're going to adjust these images so that it, you know, it looks good on every single item that we, that we have it on. You know what I mean? We don't, just because it's passive and just because it's anonymous, we don't want to just throw anything out there. We want to make it where, uh, you know, people actually want to buy it. Look at this. Look at this. Woo! Butterball salad juice junkie. All right, so now I'm going to I'm just going to adjust it and want to go up here to make sure it looks good on all of these shirts. Man, this is looking amazing. Sometimes I get so excited by some of this stuff, man. Um, here's how it looks on a dress. Have you imagine seeing this on a dress? This is is pretty pretty thoit. This is pretty thoit, man. I want to put this right there and try to get it. Here we go. Let's see what it looks like up there. Uh, it's a little off center. So, all right, we're going to put that. And then I'm going to do something funky, like make this dress yellow or something. Look at that. And then look at that. <laughs> that looks pretty wild. That is pretty wild. So then I'm going to go right here where the image is. On the phone, you got to The only thing I don't like is that you got to look at the actual image. You got to scroll back up to make sure it actually looks decent. And uh, but there you go. So I'm going to see what this looks like in a. Yeah, I'm going to give it that turquoise color. Yeah, there we go. There we go. This doesn't cost us a thing. Only our time. Look at how good these items are looking right now. It only costs us our time and our time is the most precious asset. That's why we're doing things with our time. That's going to pay us over and over again in the future. The key here is to, this might look simple. It might look like it's all, oh, you you know, this is just little stuff. No, this ain't little stuff. When you do this over and over again, as much as I've done it in multiple ways, this stuff adds up. Okay. It freaking adds up. And this is called making sure you pay yourself in the future as well. All right. So that's all we're doing. We're just doing things in the present moment that's going to pay us over and over again in the future. I teach I teach this stuff every Thursday night and every Monday night, 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time as the at, at the time of this recording. OK, I have been thinking about going back to once a week because it's a lot on my time. But uh and then, you know, supplementing that with what I'm doing here on, on this platform. So now let's do this. You know, I hope all is well in your reality. You know, I'm showing you this because I believe that sharing is caring and I want to share the wealth with you. Oh, look at the curtains right there. This looks real good. I'm going to just leave those curtains alone. Let's scroll down. Pet blanket. I'm, you know, I'm just going to put it on everything. Why not? Everything that we possibly can, it looks decent. So we'll gonna put it on this mat. Everything that we possibly can that looks decent. All we're doing is just, we're jacking viral content. That's it. I'm going to disable this. I'm not putting it on. I'll take this back. I'm not putting it on every, everything. But 
anything that it looks good on, we're going to put it on. So now we're going to edit the backpack here. It doesn't always get the image right in the beginning, so you just want to be mindful of that. You just want to center things up. I think it looks good on the notebook as well. I'm just going to tighten it up just a little bit. You know, just center it up a little bit. And then I'm going to do the background of that black. That way it stands out. Look at this. Okay. So then I'm going to do it on the on this book right here as well. But what we're going to do is we're just going to bring it to the front cover of the book because we don't want the words to, you know, be all over the place. And we're going to make this book kind of that turquoise color as well because that stands out, you know, and it's all about making things that stand out, things that are going to catch people's attention. Like they're already the reason why this is important. I don't know if I explained the entire philosophy to you, but the reason why this is important is because when this stuff starts going viral, people start searching online for content or merch and or merch related to that viral piece of content. And what we want to do is we want to be the ones that show up when people start searching for it. Now, when we publish this, it's not like we're going to show up overnight all the time. Um, this takes time for it to start ranking and things of that nature. So, uh, you know, just be patient if you publish it and it doesn't start ranking within a couple of days. Just be patient. Chill out. Just go on to another product and, you know, just repeat the process over and over and over again. That's all you're doing. I really like this, uh, this apron right here. So now we're just going to adjust it, but I really like it. I really, really like it. Look at that. That looks real good. And I'm going to make that apron. I'm, I'm, I'm going head over heels for like that turquoise look right now. And then I like the jigsaw puzzle as well, but I don't think it's the right size for that puzzle. Um, let's put it on this tank top also. All right, we got it on the tank top there. And we're just going to adjust it just a little bit. Disable it there. I'm going to put it on the dress. But I'm going to... I'm going to put that all over that dread. Look at that. Okay, I'm, I'm, I like that. I'm just, even though that cover, I, you know what? Let's put it all over that too. All right. And then, wow, look at the leggings. We're putting it over, over everything. Over, literally over everything. We're not holding anything back here. But what we're going to do, oh, look at that backpack. That's hot. That's hot. Even the colors alone, okay? The colors alone are hot. And then we got the duffel bag as well. We're just going to put it on that too. Why not? So now what we're going to do, okay, how you label everything is very, very, very important. So we're not reinventing the wheel. We're just going to go over here and we're going to take this title, copy it, and we're going to just paste it right here. I don't know why my uh, why my copier isn't working here. So let's copy. And then we'll go over to here. And then boom. And I'm just going to say watch my ping. I'm going to add something to it. Go bang. And then I'm going to say TikTok viral trend in the title as well. So then I'm going to go back over to it. And here are some of the hashtags. Let's go back. Some of the hashtags that were used. So FYP, anime. So let's go back and put anime and I'll say nine min Miller and then nine uh, pink nine mm 
go bang. And all we're trying to do is put keywords in here that we think is going to be searched. And then I'm going to say uh, TikTok trend. And then trendy. And then pink anime. Um, and then I'm going to say TikTok viral trend. And I'm going to say uh, that it's inspired by a TikTok. Inspired by TikTok viral trend. Okay. That's it. That's all I'm going to put in there right now. And then look how good this stuff looks. You can't even tell me that if you came across this in a store, it wouldn't grab your attention. It would definitely grab your attention. So now I'm just going to do design and illustration. Is this mature content? No, I agree. And then I'm going to save my work. And it's starting to be processed. This is how you make that passive income online, guys. This is how you do it. Passive, passive, passive income. Some of it's small, some of it's tall, but we are going to profit off of it all. That's how you make it. Watch my 9mm go bang. TikTok viral trend. This is how we do it. Look at how good this looks. Look at how good this looks. Holy Majoli. Holy Majoli. Jolie McFoley. Holy Majoli. This is absolutely phenomenal. Make no mistake about it. This, look at even, even on the bedspread right here. This is hot merch. <laughs> this is super super hot. It's Robbie Cornelius with Web Asset Group. Guys, go here. We got the mastermind. We got courses. We got in-person meetings. If you're in Georgia, if you want to come in and see me, you know, you can book a session with me. We have free blogs. You can message me. And we even have meditations all designed for entrepreneurs to help entrepreneurs master their minds and make money online. It's Robbie Cornelius with Web Asset Group. Make sure you give a thumbs up. Thumbs up if you like the video and make sure you subscribe. Talk to you soon.